Hi, how are you? I hope you guys are all well today. Um, hi Libra, we are doing your 2019 December love reading. We are going to find out from Spirit what is going on in your love life and some of the things that you need to know. So by the way, hi, my name is Deborah, and this is my channel Energy of Everything. Thank you so much for clicking on and watching this video. So I'm going to shuffle your cards. I'm going to take out two cards. Oh, by the way, please, I would love it if you guys like the video, if you give it that thumbs up and um, then also uh, subscribe as well and hit the notification button. I have got 2020's love predictions for the whole year coming out after the 15th of December. So you can go there and check out what is going on with next year's energies with regards to relationships. Okay, so let us have a look and see. I'm going to be drawing two cards out that represent your energy. Two cards that represent a person or an ex-person, an incoming person, any kind of person, as long as it's a person. Okay, that's what we need. <laughs> we need people. We need somebody. Let it be a person. I think my, my soulmate's a cat, but it's cool. <laughs> okay, so let us ask Spirit. Spirit, please come in for Libra and let us find out what are the energies for my Libras. Okay, let us have a look. So we are going to draw first card. That's you. Page of Wands reversed. Hmm, interesting. Okay. Also you. Same energy. Kind of same energy. Let's have a look. This is the person that you are dealing with. Hmm. Libra, Libra, Libra. What? What? Let's talk guys. What is going on? Oh gosh, okay. Let us have a look at, oh yeah, what, Libra, can I come over there to you and slap somebody upside the head? Somebody is doing something not nice. There's been a lot of stress going on here. 2019, really, it's been a year and a half. So, yeah, this card, your past energy look at this person sitting up in bed i'm just not happy guys <laughs> i want to just draw the outcome card for you guys i'm not actually going to um turn it over i'm going to turn it over at the end it's always good to kind of like let the outcome surprise you because life can teach us the weirdest lessons ever known to humanity trust me i know so let's have a look at the outcome which we're going to put aside Spirit, what is the outcome in this situation, in this relationship? I actually do feel that this is an ongoing relationship or a relationship that may have ended or could be on the brink of ending because there's some, or people are making decisions. Just like lost in this now, <laughs> looking at all this. I'm going to leave this one here. Let us have a look and see what Spirit is going to say about all of this. First of all, the first energy, I mean, the Ten of Cups, Something is going on with your energy. Something is happening in this relationship that is causing disruptions. I mean, the situation is not, not bad. I mean, it's not good. Yeah, I'm not going to lie. But there seems to be some kind of outside disruptions going on. Stuff is happening from outside. I don't know if you are listening to people outside of you and they are telling you things about this person or advising you your family is coming in and they are advising you about your relationship um, but this is causing you stress um, you know I just feel like there's somebody else you're talking to I also feel that you in this relationship are the younger person or you are the person that is um, kind of like reliant upon your partner in some kind of way don't mean to say like codependent or anything, but it could be like um, you need them. And there's you got this household set up and everything seems to be fine. But now there's this interference coming in with this 10 of cups reversed. Like my mother-in-law is interfering in my relationship kind of thing. That's the vibe that I'm picking up. And we've got page of wands reversed. I do feel you are the younger energy. And there is a fly buzzing around. If you see it, I'm going to do something to it. <laughs> Maybe that's like your mother-in-law energy coming in. Someone's interfering. Now there's a fly interfering. Imagine. Uh, yeah, there's just this, uh, I believe that you, 
I feel like you're kind of reliant upon this person and you have created a good thing, but there's outside interference. There's, there's this outside interference going on. And we've got this Eight of Cups reversed on the other side here. This is their energy. These two cards are their energy. And there's this Eight of Cups reversed. We've got two of, uh, two of Pentacles also reversed. You. So um, this person is like make two of This is a decision. This is the decision. Um, they're trying to figure out what is going on in the relationship. Um, is people telling them things? This is a lot of outside interference going on in your Libra. What is going on? Because they also trying to make decisions. They also sitting here. They definitely feel like there's definitely this two of pentacles reverse is a decision to be made. They re-evaluating with that eight of cups. They are thinking, do I, do I, do what do I do? in the situation because in your past we've got that nine of wands over there so there's definitely been stress in this relationship there has been fights in the relationship stress sleepless nights kind of stress and i think your person is in this place of deciding what to do and i still feel like there's this whole bunch of um people involved i don't know why is there so many people involved what is going on guys why is there people involved? You want to move on with this whole thing. You're looking at the one thing that you want. You want this thing to go. There's a whole bunch of stress. All I'm getting is there's people involved. Family, friends, uh, advice given to you, advice given to them. They're just trying to decide what to do. Um, I feel like they feel that they can't handle what is happening. It's just too much for them. They're juggling. You see, this person's juggling. They're trying to juggle what is happening in the situation and where they've come from. Eight of this, this um, nine of swords energy. I mean, that just says everything. Swords is pain, guys. Swords is pain. And this is a situation where the past of this relationship is just um, worrying and not sleeping and just overwhelmed. They are overwhelmed, by the way. This energy is overwhelmed energy. And I still just get this feeling that, that you need them. Like, I hope you don't need them financially um, for your life. Uh, you know, if that's a situation that you're in, oh my goodness, guys, you got to get yourself out of that. If that's one thing spirit is going to say, it's going to say, stand up on your two feet. Never need somebody for your own happiness. You know what I mean? You have to be okay. This is even advice for me. I'm the same as well. Um, a lot of, um, we've got two knights here in your present and your future. Knight's energy, it's um, quite strong energy. It's not a page. Okay, it's not page energy. It's mature energy. So I'm looking at this and I'm wondering like, okay, come through a lot of stuff. This person's still making a decision. And you are looking at this and you're going, um, uh, have we matured in this relationship? have we matured because night energy is not page energy it's not the young i'm still trying to figure it out it's like i've been there i've thought enough about figuring everything out and now we've got this um night energy going on here and it's reversed so there is a lot of I th the energy for me is just literally mirroring you right now because insecure, not, not knowing. And this, this thing that comes up again is this lack of self-worth. I actually feel the present energy is mirroring how you're feeling. Like, are you strong enough if this person walks away to handle this thing? Um, wow, I just, you know, picking up this, this defeated feeling and I don't like it. Um, you know, sometimes we're with a person because they look good. Because they can take care of us. And that's not why we should be with them. Because it will not actually help you. It's actually going to break you. If we look at a person and we go, this person can, they, they're everything. They are the package and they can take care of me. They can be okay with me. Um, that actually 
you think it's going to help your life. You think it's going to give you this Ten of Cups world. You think it's going to give you this, but it doesn't actually do that because there's a thing that happens when uh, this is for this definitely for a specific group of uh, Libras out there. This is a specific read. So if it doesn't resonate with you, then it's not your energy that I'm picking up on. But there is somebody out there who needs to hear this. Woo, let's go. Let's go there. Um, when, where was I? I got this message going through. It was like when we meet somebody. I say we. I know. I know. Okay, I've been there. We meet somebody and they are the perfect person to take care of us. We may not be standing on firm foundation like they are. I mean, we've got two knights energy here. Uh, they are reversed, but that's a horse they are. They're not walking. Unfortunately, in this card, you, you're walking. So you may not have that strength that you feel that they have. And then they come and they complete your, your life. And it looks <clears throat> like this. But in long term, it ends up upside down. I've got a light shining so you can see. And this has caused so much stress because you know what? When one person it's higher, more stronger in a relationship and has more power, and then the other one doesn't have that much power, it leads to this kind of situation because give somebody power and see what they do with it. You, they, you can end up getting taken for granted. You can end up getting kind of pushed aside and not taken seriously even by family by friends because they don't view you as a person who's like mm, strong I'm okay um, future energy shows a lot of things going on in the future in December there's gonna be a December OMG guys is a month of chaos and there's a lot of like this there's something going on with you guys there's gonna be a lot of things happening and you know what I said that there's gonna be people interfering and we're moving into December energy here. And this is people time. So there's going to be a lot of people coming around. And they're all going to have something to say. Honestly, I want to check the outcome on this one. I want to check. Okay, all right. Whew, we have a tower reversed. Oh, I'm lying, man. Why do we have a tower reversed, guys? OMG. Maybe there is a sign that things are passing. And let's hope so. Not a tower reversed. Sorry, it's a six of swords. Okay, once again, swords energy. Um, and I actually felt that, that immediately when I said tower reverse, tower reverse is like the worst is over <laughs> kind of vibe, hey? And it's like the things happened, and it is kind of like that, even though it's a six of swords, but you know, it still has this kind of tower thing. There's somebody coming out of the tower, so six of swords, okay. And it is actually showing situation is going to improve, it is going to get better, but not as quickly as you want it to. Because you've been in this energy and you're like, I'm so done. They could have been tower moments. But it continued after each tower moment. It's like, we're breaking up. We're not breaking up. Is this relationship happening? Is it not happening? Causing all the stress. And now December's coming up. We've got this erratic, crazy, lot of things to do kind of behavior. And this is going to cause a delay for you to actually work on the situation because of this delay card which is six of or six of swords this is like saying things are going to improve but not as smoothly as i wanted to and because we're moving into this this festive season people are around that is the thing i just feel like there is people talking and i don't like people talking so you know what because you are the page of wands and you want you have this but you have this outside interference let's get through this december month and let's see they undecided about things i think people also talk in their ears about you and what they should be doing with you so at the end of the day the thing is you cannot change a person you cannot make a person think a certain thing that you want them to think they're going to think what they want to think and they are also going to make the choice and decision to listen to who they want to listen to Nobody is holding a gun to their head and say, listen to me or else. They're making that conscious decision and choice as well. You know, let's, December is a month that we can do a lot of things, but not a lot of practical things. So I'm getting this thing of like, you know what? Let's get through December. Try as much as possible not to let other people outside influences influence this relationship. And we're going to head into January. I think we're going to read again in January. There's going to be a little bit of a delay in the solving of this problem. It's not over though. 
they are not decided. Maybe let them see for themselves. People will teach you the biggest lessons, but your lesson I feel is you, you turn yourself around. That's always my lesson for life because you know, um, you turn yourself around, you focus on what you want, focus on your energy for now. This is a good card reading. Let's get out of this, this situation here. Spirit, please, I'm asking to actually help shift this energy for my Libra. The person who is listening to this, I'm asking you to help shift this energy. Let them get through December in one piece so that January's energies can come through. I do have this feeling like there is a change coming, positive change coming. Just have patience through December. Libra, that is your message and um, patience, guys. But I, there is positive shift coming one way or the other. It is going to happen for you that you're finding yourself in a better place in 2020. That's what I'm 100% picking up on. Just get through December with all this. Let's see how it unfolds with the situation with them. Let them choose. Let them make a decision. But I promise you, they will regret because you did. Your focus is on this beautiful image here. So let's see what's going to happen. Let's December 2020 pass. People will teach you and they will also teach them the lessons they need to learn as well. <laughs> that spirit message guys thank you so much for listening um hit that like and notification the subscription as well and yeah let's see what your 2020 live prediction are going to be that's a quite a read guys it's going to take a long time there you go thank you so much guys love you so much bye